G'day everybody, and welcome back for some more Icarus on Prometheus now, or a map that's Prometheus, which means we're back in the purple fogs, mists, and Capac and I are dreaming of building cliff-spanning bases in the future. We have a long way to go for that. Do you remember what we were doing right at the end? I think we'd just gotten this short-range radio, so we were potentially going to do a mission. Yeah, we pretty fun. much just got the base up and running, and yeah. we got the that thingamajig. Yeah, do we want to do this distress call mission? Start off? Uh, what difficulty is it? One. Uh, four. then sure. Hey, Prospector. This place oh. is pretty different from the rest of the Terra Zone, huh? Data on this section of Icarus <laughs> oh, yeah, is prediction. limited and mostly classified. <laughs> Ooh, what we do know that. is the terraforming did not work. On the topic of not working, I have a brand new bit of experimental garbage for you. Ooh. The UDA is testing out some ground there you go, prediction begun. new tech. Some kind of AI. I think they can replace me with some 8-bit bag of bolts with attitude hardly pay me anything anyway. Simple? Yeah. Simply not needed. It's not like I'm some damn Luddite, but hell, I'm more valuable than a talking toaster. I'm... Oh, <clears throat> sorry. Um, <laughs> it'll be in an OES pod nearby. Hey, John. Go grab the thing. All right, let's go grab the thing. Hey, Rhino Dino. Ooh. What's ooh? I heard a monster. Ah. Uh, uh oh. Um, we might want to empty our inventory oh, before we do too much of this. And there's a... What the hell is that? This damn place. You can either take it out or sneak past it. Either way. We yeah, need knife in the back chip. of the head. Oh. Looks like oh. land wasn't the only thing <laughs> adapted around here. UDA hasn't been very forthcoming with information, but I've heard rumors. Uh, Some of them are it. locals. Some seem to be altered versions of Earth wildlife. All of them weird and probably dangerous. I wouldn't venture too far out unless you're. Oh, did you already pick the thing up? Yourself. Yep. All right, you got the stupid thing. Go ahead and plug it into your short-range radio get it online i see this is the third version they've worked on and it seems only good for basic errands so you'll still have me around for a while let's see just how awful it really is okay <clears throat> so we're augmenting our radio uh, oh interact with the radio Hello, Prospector. Not just Simplified Mission Prospector Liaison Version 3. Connection there, there. I refer to me as Simple. Bloody stupid robot. My function is to guide you through basic assignments for the UDAA. Communication is one way. Mm, I'm <laughs> Your first mission is to cultivate and harvest one tomato. <laughs> Seriously? This frequency will be reserved for exclusive automated prospector guide use. Terminating redundant connection. Hold on! What did you call me, you stupid? Sample quality and composition huh. will be used to calibrate <laughs> APG for future assignments. Okay. You will be provided the applicable hybrid seed. Glad they made Soul not happy with the rubbit. Samples consisting of incorrect genetic material will be rejected. Please begin. Alright, Robert. Well, at least we got one farm plot now. Uh, tomato. Okay. Good start, Prospector. Here, have some praise. Well done. Uh, congratulations. I always knew you could do it. Oh. She had to give me praise just as I gave myself diarrhea. Good job. Thanks. <clears throat> I always knew I could do it. You just had to believe in yourself. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> I earned it. Exactly, Nuki World. <laughs> Did you just kill a goat, or was that just a goat running around, running away? No, it was a rabbit. Ah. Uh. Just getting rid of these farm plots. What? You get rid of all the farm plots? Uh, dirt mounds, I should say. I should probably get my chat up. That would make sense. Good job. <laughs> Alright. Uh, what do I need to make farm plots? Uh oh. Uh, there's a mower Take eating more. the house. Oh, multiple moe! Giant. Stop. Stupid. Bird. Oh. oh. I threw so many knives just then. And missed a lot. Again. Hey, look, Capac doesn't have any of my knives in him. For once. I think I could change it if you'd like. Uh, all right. What? Oh, you're growing tomatoes. Yep, I'm also picking up my knives that I'm finding around the place. Probably make some more. Uh, maybe not. Uh, okay. Uh, I want to make some light source in here. So I don't have any points available. Well, poop. Job. more stamina in solo, why not? I don't care about my solo tree, really. Yeah, my knives are supposedly highlighted. I can't see them. I don't see a highlight on them. Oh wait, do I have to make new ones that are highlighted? I don't know. Thanks, Rando Dino. Thank you for four months. I get a different stack? Nope, they're the same. We need to make an upgrade bench for this game so you can take previously made items and apply new yep. upgrades to them. Agreed. And so that you could like upgrade like, hey, your level friend's up. gear as well. Lucky 13. Yeah, I think so. I agree. Uh, but the tracking... I unlocked the tracking talent. Uh, in combat. Where is it? Or did I? Yeah, thrown knives are highlighted. Except I'm not seeing the highlights. So it might be broken. Talents... Uh... Let's carry weight for wood. Attention Prospector, a new work order has been received. One of your fellow contractors has been severely injured and returned to orbit for treatment. They have requested help in locating and escorting their pet blueback that was abandoned during extraction. What? You are advised that once the aforementioned creature has been escorted back to the contractor's encampment, oh. you may make use of any of the supplies left behind. Additionally, the contractor wanted the following message passed to you. 
Please, please save Daisy. Daisy. She saved me more times than I can count. It's the least I can do for her. The contractor currently lacks a functional trachea. I did my best to substitute. Uh, you may be uh, Apparently I don't have highlights turned on because I turned them off because they were annoying me. But I don't know where it... Yeah, it sounds like something you'd do. What? Yeah, there we go. Now I got highlights on it. Oh, it was because I was annoying me with all the plants. This game feature is annoying me. I'm going to turn it off, even though it might be useful. Well, I mean, to be fair, it was annoying. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't, I don't think I did, did dumb. I think I did fine. Stupid mowers. Maybe? No, it's a crocodile. There is a crocodile attacking our house. No, there's a mower attacking your face. Mm. Ah, there's, there's a mower as well. Oh, I'm stuck on the door. I'm stuck. I can't move. Oh, the crocodile's on me. Help. Help. I can't get out. Well, I'm going to die. Yep. That's not fair. Oh no. I'm also gonna die. Oh, maybe not. Oh, missed. Help. No. Get to the water, that you, then you'll be safe. Yes. I mean, Kamak was stuck. The door had nothing to do with it. I was stuck in the corner of the building. Yeah. He was stuck the same place I was. <laughs> Yeesh. What? Why do you want on a real we'll be right back screen? Uh, because I was just switching something over. <clears throat> so I could read it properly. Gonna leave me alone. If I go far enough away, and then can I go and revive Kappa? Uh, the Minecraft RTX stream. That was ages ago. Uh, I'll have to have a look. Some dude. I'll check it out. Huh. I never saw Splitzy again. I'm on my way. De aggroed the crocodile. What? Two respawns remaining? What does that mean? What? That's what it says. Uh. That's not good. Yeah, the trailer knives. Why does it say two respawns remaining? I don't know. Scythe? <laughs> oh, during this mission? Scythe usually reads the the notes, so I thought he might know. Choose Ow. prediction outcome! Kappa. Prediction. New prediction. Who will die next? Only 42% were on you, Kappa. People really think I'm going to get myself into trouble.
Uh, can I not pick up a mower? Or is it because I got my shield? Ow! Ground. Corpses around us, are they? Track the yeah. uh, predators. Not that I'm aware of. Okay. So apparently, that's become more of a thing. So the predators will come even more so after you when you've got stuff. What? What do you mean you can only sleep near an active campfire? I'm right next to this fire pit. Prospector, your sample has Seems grown fun. to an acceptable maturity and is ready for processing. Please place it in the OES pod for retrieval. Uh, have you got meat from the thing? What? Oh, I might put some dried meat out. Oh no, wait, that meat doesn't dry. Oh, I put all the cooked food in the drying rack. Just for storage purposes. Ah, uh, okay. It's just there was quite a bit of stuff there, so I was wondering whether you had any more. Uh, where's my farm at? Oh, down it comes. Sure, if this has been brought up before, but we have a new way of doing things now. Cenotai have come up with a fancy new way of shipping your exotic hauls off. Oh, that's done a lot of damage to our base. Calling it the orbital exchange system. What? OES. Yeah, then. Abandoning all your planet side tech is a thing of the past, if you prefer. Chuck them in the pod, then it drops it all off at the station. Pretty cool, huh? It's free for now while they're still testing the pods. Who knows how much cash they'll rake. Hooray, 25 player. gold ore. It works in reverse, too. Say you want to order some shiny new gear from the workshop up there, you can get it delivered just by pressing a few buttons. <laughs> what a time to be alive. All right. Kabak, do you want some watermelons so that you've got some... Watermelons? what you want them for. Yeah, I'm alright. Go in the drying rack, why not? I only need one stack. Let's dry some tomatoes. Uh, don't need the shovel, it can go in there. Have you unlocked making a backpack? You brought a backpack with you, didn't you? Yep. Well, I've got to unlock making a backpack. I should have brought a backpack with me, actually. Actually, can we buy stuff from the... Or do I have to leave the game to be able to do that? Doesn't he just talk about how he could order stuff? Yeah. I wasn't listening. Were you? Not really, but then I wasn't planning on doing it. <laughs> yeah, I'm wondering if we've got to get a different type of thing. You can order stuff from workshop and have it delivered. Need the orbital thing. Is the orbital thing a high tier thing? Orbital exchange. Tier 2. Orbital exchange interface. Ah, I can make one of these. Maybe. We might not have enough copper. Yeah, we don't have enough copper. We're gonna go do some mining. 
Also, we might want to sleep. Okay. Alright, mining. Where did we... Do you remember where we saw a cave that was nearby? <clears throat> um, no. I think that was one underwater? I mean, there's got to be some over near these, like, cliffs right. over here. Well, let's let's go north then and explore that way. See if there's oh. one. I was going to say south, because there's, like, cliffs right here. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, he's, like, from the cliff that's just to the west and then head north, because we haven't explored that way Wait, on the map. Shouldn't we be heading... North, east. Because that's where our mission thing is. Yes, if you want to do the mission straight away, or if you would rather get... Let me get a backpack. Well, that's boring. <laughs> what do you want a cave for? Uh, copper. Stop running, stop running. Oh! Tail shot! <laughs> oh, that is deeply embedded in the rock. Uh, I found corn. Do you want me to get some corn? Uh, let me get the corn. Where are you at? Are you on the far side of the, the rock I'm just pillar? a little bit up the river. Okay. You're going the wrong way. You're going into a swamp. What? Are you in a cave? No. Look. On my map, you're in a swamp. Oh, I thought I could go around the... I thought that was just a pillar. I thought I could go around the thing. Also, I've annoyed a biscuit. Of course you have. Ah! Ow! Oh, there's a pig! Oh! Oh, boy. No! Ow! Ow. Oh, I'm slowed. You're leading slime monsters back to our house? What else am I supposed to do? I'm gonna get my stuff all slimy. No! I'm down. I didn't have my meat on my hotbar! Alright, 71% on me that time. Alright, let's start another prediction. Oh, we won't come back to, uh... if we can kill this thing. Oh, camera control's back in Spectator. Why is it so fast? Can you see why I died? Well, I will, Stab too it. will be dead. Stab it in the face with your regular knife. Would be nice if I could. Or go revive me while it's not chasing you up that cliff, little cliff bit. It's stuck, Kapak. Go revive me. And I can help you. Because it'll eventually figure its way out up the way up there and Ah oh, my logs! Capac! Eat some food, get some health! I need bandage. You need meat. 
Eat all of the meat. Like, even when you're full, just keep eating. And then go revive me! You want to talk? Hey, I I didn't think I was going to be able to kill that crocodile, so I ran it away from our base, and then I came back and revived you. The slime one's uh, it's still there. Yeah. Come on, I'm to the left. I know where you are. So why are you underneath the slime monster? What? That's not where it's showing me. I am. Um, uh, it's showing oh me boy. further up the river. It's attacking my logs. <laughs> oh no, they'll drop as logs when they get destroyed. I definitely misinterpreted the rock formations around here. Yeah, is it still... Can't tell if it's still following me or if it's just wandering around. It's wandering now. So if you creep, you might be able to... But get a sneak shot on it. that on my hotbar. So that's what I needed. There we go. another oxygen bag. <laughs> Not mean to hit Tilda. Ah, uh, we shouldn't have one death left. We didn't use our respawn. Capac revived me. Okay, so just further up the river, you said. Uh, which side of the creek was the corn on? Going up on the left. Yeah, so the, the big rock formation on the left, I thought that was a circle and I could go around the other way. Well, you I, thought wrong. That is true. I did think wrong. Did just one shot another drac though. Eh, that's probably enough. Oh, I think I remember this area. I think there's a cave up here. Uh, we've never been here. Mm, pretty sure we have. It's not showing on my map. As explored, so I haven't been here. Well... Oh, 
does look similar to another bit we went around though. Don't see a cave here though. <clears throat> Alright, we continue. The search continues for the cave. Oh, what's this plant? You want some tea? How about some tea? Sure, why not? There we go, got oh. some tea seeds. And a cave. Yep, that looks like a cave. Uh, Alright, we gotta kill the worms. Uh, I didn't get any of my knives back. Uh, are there any trees nearby? Nope. One sec. Need timber to make the bone knives. Uh, I'll just make a bunch of stone knives. Oh no, I'll make you some bone ones. Just give me a sec. We definitely want whatever damage we can get from these because it is that much harder. Oh, Kabak, are you going to take on any ranged equipment other than knives, or are you going to stick to knives? Like, are you going to go javelin? Oh, are they throwing uh, axes that I'm not aware of? Uh, I'm probably not going to actually spec into anything until guns in terms of ranged stuff. Okay. I was <laughs> just going to respec once we get to guns, like I did last time. Spec up to make myself powerful with knives, and then when we have guns, switch it. Yeah, they took out the uh, throwing axes and replaced it with berserker mode. Alright, so you need some knives. Oh wait, no, I don't. I just want to make one. One of the regular knives. No, I've already got it. No, oh, no. throwing knife. Very nice. Brain. Jeez. Brain is not working. Alright. You meet me at the cave entrance? Yeah. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. Jiggle. Stop. Right. 35 bone knives. Ah, I just made you some more as well. One down. Two down. Oh. Got lucky on that last one. See that one? That should be all of them, I think. I think so. So we're gonna mine copper and iron. While the uh, light hail is going on outside and our base is getting destroyed. Now you can recover your knives from these drop bags. Yeah, but you said you needed more knives, so I figured I'd leave them to you. Well, maybe that's just my excuse for being lazy. True. I'm going to be able to make stone 
uh, bone throwing knives be? Like, because the bone arrows with the bone, with the bow was really quite effective, but I don't have, like, I don't have higher tier bows, as it were, to make them more effective. I probably do need to upgrade to throwing knives of other types and then actually rem go Whoa. around collecting them. There's a drac in the cave. Oh. You gonna kill it? Out. Like I was standing right next to you. I don't have enough sulfur. Just make a regular torch. Nah, that's boring. Sure, you do you. Uh, cave doesn't have a lot of stuff. Get the copper we then should be able to buy the like build the mission board thing sorry the trading beacon well i got a copper build. boulder over here good good i've got a stack and a bit of copper We should probably just get ourselves fully loaded up with as much as we can carry. Since we're not far from home. Although, I now have cave lung. Oh, stupid stamina! heavily encumbered so i think it's time to head on home because the storm is just about done oh i've got a bunch of your stone throwing knives yeah you like them or would you like some bone ones here you go have some bone ones Jeez, 50. Yeah. What, you didn't want me to be nice and give you a whole bunch? I got 57, that's too many. Yeah, cave line pretty much is minus 90% stamina. You stupid rock. Oh, I'm incumbent, I'm incumbent. I may as well grab as much as I can count. Fit. With cave lung, I'm basically dead anyway. If something decides to attack us, I can't kill it. I am also in cave and lung and. Oh, great. We're both in trouble. Uh. Well, I did get a level up. Oh, cool. 
Don't die. Two more talent points. <laughs> Alright. Mm. I'm starting the slow <clears throat> walk home. Should probably have a knife out. Uh, combat. One. Uh, two. Oh, not enough. Speed. Enough points. Yeah. More knife damage. Give me all the life. knife damage. Oh yeah, it is a good thing that cave lung doesn't stack. That would suck. That would be very annoying. Oh, what, that's sensing me over the hill. Are you friendly or are you foe? A rabbit. Ah. You know, jumping uses up your stamina. Yeah, and also traverses small obstacles. <laughs> it's so distracting. That also uses stamina. Less. Because you have to run further. Where's Medicine Man Kapak when you need him? Well, Kapak's not playing Medicine Man this time. Oh, I'm an axe man. We've mixed it up a bit. Uh, there's a mower ahead of us. There's nothing you can't cure with an axe. That's what I say. I can't think of anything that would play well with that. Oh. I was trying to think of a, an illness that had axe in the name that would make sense to not be cured by an, by an axe. Ah, stupid piranha fish. <laughs> oh, right. That's what I need to do. And use some of my things to unlock defensive walls. Extra copper, put all my extra seeds away. Oh, well, I don't like being poisoned and cave lunged. I imagine not. That should be enough copper. Now let's get this thing. Nope, cooking station. Uh, what else do I need for this? Rope and wood. Give 
Ammo arrived. Alright, I'm really curious how this is going to work. If it's just exactly the same, or if whether there's an extra cost or something. Request equipment. Workshop. Okay. Um. Armors? Survival backpack. Plus 12 suit inventory slots. Wow. Okay. That's kind of nice. Plus six, reload, bows, crossbow, arrow speed. Oh. I just want the basic one. Chumpy, 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 chumpy. I got plenty of oxygen, cluts. I just got the cave lung. Alright. Uh. Jeez, that's a lot of axe-based puns in chat. <laughs> also, where'd the drop come? Hello? Drop? Uh-oh. There, yeah, pink. Alright. I now have a backpack. Which means I can carry a whole lot more stuff. And also move a bit. Come back, are you just gonna try and entomb us in wood? Yes. Right. I figured that might have been your plan. Just thought I'd confirm. They are defensive log piles. Uh, speaking of defensive log piles... Where are those defensive log structures? Here we go. Wood gate fortification, wood wall fortification, and wood spikes. There we go. Textiles bench. Yeah, I'll leave that. There. Leave that till later. Herbalism bench. I should probably unlock. What the? Yeah. What's that glowing green thing over there? Uh, that would be the pod that dropped my backpack. Okay. So, in order to make these wall bits, I need iron nails and ropes. Okay. Cool. Let's go collect some rope materials. Let me skin you. Yes, AK1 GBR, axial spondylometaphyseal dysplasia is a genetic bone disorder. Um, what? Well, a retro encabulator? <laughs> around the 
the spine, though. Wasn't familiar with. But it probably would be cured by an axe if you cut out the spine, I guess. <laughs> yeah, spines are vestigial anyway. <laughs> Exoskeletons, that's where it's at. Yep. If you don't have a hardened chitinous carapace, you're doing it wrong. And an axe cure an accent. I mean, if it if it's applied liberally to the neck, probably. It is a topical, <clears throat> a topical therapy. Cool. That should be plenty. No, that's not right, Sif. It was a, it was a panometric fam, not a pentametric fan. Yay, a hundred rope. And I just need some nails. We should have some more iron for. I am going to make us a compound. So we can feel safe-ish. I will only feel safe once there are no more trees. All this medical talk reminds me, I really need to re renew my registration, my healthcare thing, just in case. It is that time of year. Oh, I'm going to renew my passport. I'm such an idiot. I just poisoned myself in the creek again and we've got stupid rain collectors. Uh. You right there? I'll teach you. Will it though? No. Alright, how many of these can we make? Five. Woo! I'm just going to fill up my water bottle. One sec. Ah, uh, drag attack. Drag attack? I feel like you enjoy saying that. I'm gonna need oh. more bandages. Alright, guess that works. So now we know why Splitzy is such a tree killer. Kapak is afraid of them. Yep. It all makes sense. All my time at the space orphanage, both of my parents were murdered by trees. <laughs> uh, I don't know if there are buffalo on the new map, although I just am reminded of something. Cheers. I should make this. Pick up some of Kamak wood files. trying to work toward at the moment, Kavak? More logs. 
Anything else? More logs. Would you happen to have made your, like, researched how to make axes? Like, iron axes? Oh yeah, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> yeah, because I presume you've got buffs to them, so I don't want to make them for you. I haven't even really looked at tier 2 yet. Um, let's see. Crafting bench. Okay, we've got the anvil bench. Uh, there might be a slight reduction in XP gain with the high difficulty setting. Maybe. I'm not 100% sure. I feel like it was one of the things that it says on the difficulty setting, but I'm not certain. I am sledgehammer. Yeah, remember we needed sledgehammers for that one particular node of material? Yeah, interesting. Alright, uh, iron axe, I have learned. Ah, I have used up all of that rope that I made already. What else do I want to learn? Oh, more fishing stuff. Alright, I guess I'm going... Wait a second. Let's get a wooden fishing rod and a fishing trap and a basic lure pack. Hundred percent. Ah, okay, that'll be worth it. Have you made an anvil yet? Yep. In the corner. It's very dark in here. Why you've got a torch? That you leave on so it can be burnt to a crisp and not be useful when you need it. You're making a fishing fishing bench. What? Tree sap? Where on earth do you get tree sap from? I've never seen any tree sap. You mean the thing we get from grinding twigs in a mortar and pestle? Oh, It's just they've okay. changed the picture? Yes, they have very much changed. <laughs> that chopper sounds very strange overhead. There's a chopper in the game. Uh, there's a helica chopper in the real world that I can hear overhead, but it sounded really weird because it wasn't like a constant drum. It was pulsating. Ew. Very strange. Very strange the... indeed. Ah! Moa. Like you got a fancy axe now. You can go ask it a question. Ow. Hooray, level 15. I can do more things. I don't think I can lift up a whole mower. No, I don't think you can. I think that's going to be a bit of an issue in general with the stuff that we're hunting. There's a lot that you can't take to the skinning table anyway. What? Axe puns? No, I was just quoting Futurama. Okay, so get this over here, get rid of this. 2,000 fibers. Oh, I just need so many ropes to make this wall. Oh, I've got so many bowls of fried tomatoes. Ah, pig. Die, pig. Uh, okay, so we need... We're starting to get stuff that could get attachments. So where is the upgrade bench? Is that in tier two or do we have to wait for tier three? Not sure. Right. 
right? I can't remember what it's called. So, Kavak, do you have any thoughts on um, how we want to encircle our little place here? As in, where do you want me to build the walls? Uh, well, we can use the bend of the river as a bit of a moat. Yeah, I was thinking about that. Um, like putting the walls along the top edge of this side, but then, and then having a little gap for a bridge. Which will probably get attacked a fair bit. Yep. We're going to need a lot of uh, these balls. Thanks, Valkyrie78. Thank you for the prime sub. Wood. Oh boy. Alright, we'll just leave that for a while. That's gonna be another three or four minutes. What have I got? Talent points. Unavailable. Increased damage with drone knives. Yeah. Kind of ignoring this side of things, although I should probably get. Well, that's melee. I uh, probably should get some of it. Knives degrade slower in combat. Trained Skinner. Crit damage. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna need to get some of these. Alright! Kapak! I can get the chop down trees with my knife skill. No, you can't. Ah, what the? Piggy! Why not? Because it's against the law. Yeah, I did want one of the bottom knife skills last time. Which one was it? Stay right there. Throw knife critical hits and mobilize targets. Ah. Okay, I'm gonna need to work toward that one. Um, we should probably go do this mission in the morning. Sure. Plus five percent chance to kill instantly with a knife while crouching. Yes, I want that too. Okay, there are lots of knife skills I want. I reckon these knives can get pretty good. Give it a bit of time. Uh, have you done a mortar and pestle yet? I have long, I have unlocked it. I have not made one yet, though. Uh, uh, there should be a bunch of silicon in the cupboard. Alright. But is there any stone? Also, we're still waiting for all the ropes that I queued up to be made. Ah, and something's attacking us again. There's a drag out there. Yep. It's attacking your wood piles. A rude. Oh, another one. Another one. Oh, another two. Jeez. All right, we got to clear up these corpses quickly. I got another level up. Nice. Go dense packing two, no three, and then I should be able to start getting these. I don't care about this one. Oh, you're doing all the wood two. stuff. All right, I should get dense packing two. What should I get? Well, my next one, I'm gonna get seasoned logsman. 
chopped wood is automatically added to your inventory. Um. Oh yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, I, I should put a point into that. Next point into it to, to get the, um, oh, keep hitting the tilde. Oh, more attacks. More attack directs. You are actually putting down those things as defense for our house, aren't you? Because well, the stacks are getting attacked instead of the walls. It, yeah, it seems to be working. Interesting. Aha. Make more walls. Alright, mortar and pestle is on the fireplace. Oh, the furnace. You can get your tree sap. Alright, I've got 14 wall fortifications made. And Capac's making a whole lot of leather curtains for the windows. Yep. The sound design in this game is awesome. do we need? We did not carrying all this extra meat. We're just getting insane amounts of meat here. Yep. True fact. Oops, I just did that the wrong way around. Oh well. What if the curtains flapped in the wind? Be interesting. You didn't add a thing. For sure. Alright, do you want to sleep ah. and then we can do the mission? Oh. Um. That was blindingly bright looking across at your screen and seeing white. Yeah, I accidentally clicked outside of the window and dragged over a tab from uh, <laughs> my browser. Apparently so. Oh, I can't process the gold in this. That sucks. Uh, epoxy and rope. Have you got a bunch of fibers somewhere? No, because I've been using them all to make the defensive walls we need. Yeah, I might need to harvest some more of those. Uh, what else do I need in here? Uh, epoxy. What do we need for epoxy? What What were you needing the rope for? Is that your tackle box? Yeah, some fish and stuff. Ah. Not sure how many of these walls we're going to need to enclose this space, but we kind of need to enclose a fairly large area so that we've got room for farms. Well, speaking of fun, we got some software in here. We do. Hey, okay, storm's coming to an end. I oh, yeah. smart to have waited that out. Uh, I that might just place. Can sleep. I might just place down these crop pots and <coughs> plant them before we go to bed. Oh, no! Don't do that now. Sleep. No. Sleep. No. See, I'm just waiting for you to do a farm. What's new? Just come and skin oh, these the, pigs then. What's new is the campfire is just burning down. You're like, no, I want to do midnight farming. Actually, I'm doing midnight 
pig on uh oh. I didn't make these while the rain was still falling. And they would have been full of water. Alright, what shall I plant? Uh, let's get some more. Hey, cowboy, thanks for a sub. Corn. How much simulated getting back to the future DLC? They haven't released the uh, Warhammer DLC for it yet. Yeah, I've been waiting for that one. What the? Let's grow a few random different things. Uh, all right. I need rope, so I need fiber. Split down the cans about farming. Sounds familiar, doesn't it? All right, let's go to bed. Nope, too late. I'm out here getting fibers. Uh, it'd be quicker if I got them for you. It would. I'll get them for you in the morning. But you did not. Alright, maybe that's enough. Oh, Simon, thanks for the raid. Right. Welcome, raiders. The Icarus. Yes. Uh, right. How many ropes can I make? Ooh, that's Just a bit enough. On the iron. That's Three. Oh, wait. There's 70 ropes in here already. Yeah, because I've been using them to make my walls. They take 12 or... They take 12 per bit. I only needed five. I actually didn't think I had that many when you asked me as well. I thought I'd nearly run them out from the thing that I'd made. There you go. Have you got a sickle? Because there's a bone sickle in the thing. Uh, I don't, but I'm going to leave you to all that stuff anyway. Uh, Alright. Sleep. So I can have a sleep buff before so. we go and do our thing. Okay, uh, we need to head in the direction of the blue marker. All right, Momo attacks. <laughs> oh boy, we really need those walls. Bridge might be nice too. Yep. <sighs> oh, it's very magenta. It is. Maybe a hint of fuchsia. Very slaneshy. Something I haven't thought about in a long time. What? Slanesh. When were you thinking about slanesh? Oh. Where did you even run into slanesh? Usually you're not very warhammery. You, you exposed me to a lot of random things like that. I usually don't just casually bring up Slanesh, though. <laughs> Hence why I said I think it's been a very long time. The name is very familiar in the colour palette thing.
It's also reminding me of um, an alien I can't remember the name of in uh, Mass Effect. Ahana. Yeah, that one. Ugh. Ugh. A very interesting non humanoid alien species that, that then just became a running joke in the sequels. Yep. This is why we can't have nice things, Bioware. <laughs> you know we don't need a marker because we got a marker for the tamed creature, right? Yeah, but it doesn't show up on the HUD compass. Yeah, it does. Oh, the animal does. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I forgot about that. I saw the zone on the map and put a marker on it. Fair enough. Jeez, I didn't think it was this far away. The map is bigger than it looks. Especially because we're in such an open expanse. Compared to what was present where we were hanging out for, where we were kind of running through deep valleys Wait, the, most of the time. That plateau over there is where we started. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's both further away than I thought and also a lot closer than I remember. Yeah, this valley that we're in is quite broad. Like, it's three map squares wide. We're in a bit. Don't get out of here, mower. Just make out Splitsy running off in the distance. Do you know, for a while I thought that the arrow up there was you, that's why I was running so intensely for a while. Of course. Until I realized it was the animal. So, you having said that this reminds you of Satisfactory, a few other people have said the same. Do you know what, do you know what I remember about Satisfactory that I find really quite unique for it? Uh, no. <laughs> I was wondering what you were going to come out with then. Satisfactory is one of the few games where the two of us enjoyed the same specific part and thus were frustrated by the same specific parts. Oh, the exploration stuff. Yeah. It's... From what I've seen of it recently... That has been improved and also still has some of the frustrating things from before. Yeah. It looks like they've actually broadened the, the map out so there's a bunch of new like biomes and things so it's interesting to explore. But then like all the like collectible like pickup things are still useless. Uh, I now have Daisy. What is a daisy? Daisy is equivalent to a... I don't know. What the? Uh, uh, I think it's a buffalo equivalent. Okay. Oh, drag attack! Another drag coming. Yep. Uh, where do we have to get to? Back home. I know. Head to Daisy's owner's base. South. Purple house marker on our map. Okay. Oh, another drac. <laughs> Okay, we probably right, want to head we gotta keep through moving. that way. Come on, Daisy. Another one. Uh, I don't think this is the right way. I think you're headed towards a cliff. Oh, I just stabbed the Daisy, I think. No, I didn't. Alright, you're going to carve them up. I'm going to keep moving. Uh, 
I just said I don't think that's the right way. I think you're headed for a cliff. Oh. Okay. Another drag coming in on you. Ah! Oh. Come on, Daisy. Down the safe path. I uh, just gotta leave these guys. Yeah. I, I don't have bandages. Ah, I need bandage. Well, come down here and you can get some. So many fibers. Keep moving. Oh man. There are so many. Uh I'm not sure I have anything edible for Daisy. Uh I've got fried tomato. I could try that. Curse you, escort mission! Oh. Well, at least I'm gaining levels, I suppose. Behind you, Cabot. Well, does he keep up with my sprint? Oh, there's a drag. I can't keep up with your sprint. Pretty good job of keeping up. If these are, these drank accounting towards our um <laughs> our bestiary things. Also, Cliff. Stamina. It's gonna <laughs> kill a bunny. You know, constant drac attacks and you're deciding to lose stamina to chase a bunny? Yep. Uh checks out. I feel like we'd both do that actually. Uh drac behind us. Yeah, I see it. Eat meat. I don't have any. Eat meat. Wait. Ah. Then give me back what you know. You haven't eaten. Oh no. Why did you do that? Because I need to drink. <laughs> and I'm trapped. Oh, you 
made it up. Okay. I was about to help you get back out. Thank you. Oh, more drag. Two of them. Come on, Daisy. Let's go. Let's go. Another drag across the creek. Ah. Down it goes. Uh, do we need to cross here? No, we don't want to cross here. gonna die just as we get that no no oh no just snagged on the rock come on daisy this way I can't keep up with this amount of bandage needing. <laughs> I can't stand still because then we get more Drax that are coming for the bodies as well as the ones that are coming for Daisy. Also, more. How are you not getting like lacerated every time one of these things attacks you? I kill them before they bite me. How? Knife to the face, knife to the face. Two knives to the face and they're dead. Also, is your armor busted? Uh, it's on the way, but it's not there yet. Ah! Uh, help! Where is he? Well, I'm gonna die. No! So close to saving you. I mean, I'm still probably gonna die. You're not down again, are you? No. Not yet, but I've got like five health, no oxygen. Oxygen rocks. Oh no, my knife's about to break. I can see the house. Uh, I've got a bone knife back up. I should put it on my hot bar. Come on, Daisy. There's a drag coming up behind us. I can't see where I'm aiming if I have a shield with a throwing knife. Oh, that's a bit annoying. Another drag! Yeah. Oh, 88% of points were on you then. What is the purpose of your presence in this location? Daisy requires your help. Return to your objective and escort Ooh. the organic transport. Uh. Good work, Prospector. 
The injured contractor would be greatly relieved that Daisy made it back home had they not died horribly from their wounds before I could inform them of your um, success. You may delightful. gather any supplies left on this Have a look at these uh, uh, containers over Daisy here. Oh, they... Home. Of course they did that. Previous objective and Ooh. Place the sample in the OES Own javelin. Already. There's an obsidian pickaxe in here. Yeah. Interesting. Also some obsidian and other things in the thing. Oh no. Right. I am going to level up. Chopped wood automatically in inventory and chance to instantly chop a tree. Uh, yeah, my O2's about to run out too. Oh, what is this stone that the building's made out of? It looks weird. We might be able to break this down. Scoria. Wait a second. Uh, tier two. Three doors. My favorite kind of door. Textiles bench. What the? There's an oxidizer hidden here. Basic riding saddle. Animal bed. Speed drop and water drop. Okay, what does the textiles bench need? Um, I was thinking we might make a textiles bench here. I can then make the saddle to ride Daisy. We can then put a bunch of these building materials inside Daisy's inventory and then we have stone stuff at our base. Okay. So what we... Did you already pick up the crafting table? Yeah. Can you put it down, please? Yes, so. Are you encumbered? Uh, I was. Uh, we need 12 stone, 50 wood, and 20 sticks. Okay, hold on a sec. Twelve stone. Ah, uh, yes. Daisy is mine. 50 wood. Uh... I don't have enough wood, oh. but uh, everything else is in there. Uh, there aren't any trees nearby. Oh, hold on. I've got an idea. If I... Oh, if we break this thing down, it might give us enough wood. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. It's... Oh yeah, there's enough wood in there. What did you want? Uh, I want to make a textiles bench. Textiles bench. I think there's enough materials yep, in there for it. there is. I'm making one. Uh, then I gotta see what we need to be able to make one of the saddles for Daisy. All right, saddle needs two rope. Requires shelter. What? Urgh. Apparently, this doesn't count as being sheltered. Curse you, Valheim! All right, what do you need? Uh, nothing. Kill this bunny then. How do I equip a saddle on the animal? Oh, there's a sign here, but there's nothing written on it. Huh? 
Oops. How do I put the saddle on Daisy? Uh, you access its inventory? Yeah, but Daisy doesn't seem to have a slot for putting a saddle on. Then maybe you can't put a saddle on it. Oh, do I need a special saddle that I don't have the tech for yet? Equip, equip a saddle in order to access this thing. Yeah, I don't see a slot anywhere. Wait, uh, maybe can you, if you're holding the saddle and you... I think you... I need a pack harness, which needs the advanced textiles bench, so we can't do it. Well, that was a waste of time. Oh, we could come back here and get stuff. Yeah, I guess so. Um, you know, if we survive the trip home. Yeah. Oh, this wood and stuff out here. I'm not a fan of this look of the stone. Very busy. Well, it's got all barnacles on it. Yeah, I know. It makes it look very busy. So yeah, so we'll come back to this and grab all the stuff once we've dropped off what we got. And dropped off Daisy. Uh, cool. Right, where's home from here? I think the blue marker's at home, isn't it? Nope. It is now, though. Alright. Come on, Daisy. Keep up. No, I don't even care. Bunny! Hopefully we've still got access to the regular stone. And it's not all scoria. What do you think the chances are of Daisy surviving more than one night? Uh, two. Yeah, I, I think that's pretty accurate. Uh, oopsie, no. Well, sort of. And then I decided that I'm not going to do missiles in assertive acquisitions anymore. question asked was, did I ever get them working? Alright, give them my bandages. Yeah, I'll have to make a barn for Daisy. Eventually. Well, I did get the, uh, the animal bed of the feeding troughs. Yeah, so Kabak, obsidian stuff inflicts the burning modifier. Yeah, I saw that. Um, seems very high risk. What? Well, doesn't it inflict it on your enemies? Yeah, and then what do those now on fire enemies do to you? Uh, cower in fear? That's what I would do if somebody swung a flaming pickaxe at me. <laughs> uh, there was really no reason to cross the river. No? Other than being slightly shorter, maybe. Oh, yeah. 
Oh well, it's done now. Oh man, this is so slow. I gotta unload all this stuff. Yeah, I need to make some more cupboards when we get back. To run out of storage space. What if someone swung a flaming bowl of cheese at Capac? I would Ooh. presume that you would also cower in fear and then inquire as to when you could consume it. Uh, I'd just say thank you. And eat it. Delicious molten cheese. No, no, no. Flaming cheese. As long as it's not like flaming Cheetos. Can you even really find Cheetos in Australia much anymore? No, uh, not really. It's something I only see at like, you know when you're doing uh, like a road trip and you stop at some service station somewhere. I only really see them then. It reminds me I am running a bit low on snacks. You're you're flying to Melbourne this year, right? Max? Uh at least part of the way. Mm. Huh? I will be flying to packs from Canberra. Ah, right. Makes sense. Sort of. Well, I mean, it does. Because, it, it, although it's potentially cheaper from Sydney, the flight anyway. Not once you factor in parking. Yeah. But yeah, excuse to go see the family and somewhere yeah. reasonable to leave the car without having to pay a fortune for it. Yep, seems quite fair. Yeah, that's Ugh, parking at airports. I believe we're just trying to find somewhere to. If I were to drive to Melbourne, just finding somewhere to park is just a nightmare. Yeah, that was a bit expensive last year. It's finding anywhere convenient is ridiculous. Yep. Now I've got to drive to the airport because I've got to bring a car. I've got to bring Toby's car seat and stroller and all that on the plane too. Ew. Yeah. Have fun with that. Yeah. Apparently, it's all included. Funny. At least. You're allowed two pieces of um, infant checked baggage. So that'll be the car seat and the stroller. Oh, yep. Where's that other bunny? So my other half's got family in Melbourne, so they'll be able to pick us up from the airport and can stick the kid's seat in the car then. But it means it's, for the first time in a very long time, I'll need to go and get one of those trolleys. Carts. Oh, yep. So, <laughs> without one, I can't imagine being able to carry all the bits. Because normally I just load myself up and just carry everything. and Because it makes it so much easier to move. Uh, no, a taxi wouldn't be likely to be able to carry all that no and a taxi would be more expensive than driving and parking by a lot i think even one direction the taxi would be more expensive than that 
Because when you take when you take a taxi out of area, you have to pay for their fare to get back into the their usual area as well. At that point, you may as well hire a limousine or something. It'll yeah. probably end up costing the same or less. Yeah, true. So very true. So I think the I think the price to take a taxi from where we are to the airport would be about four hundred dollars. Sorry, four hundred dollar dues. I had a cousin once that chased a bunny through a cactus patch he had so many needles in him that he almost became a cactus ow <laughs> sounds very unpleasant i can get you inside come on come on daisy no come up the stairs i think it's like um we should really open some of these windows to let the light in can't i Come on, Daisy. Fine, I'll open the windows. There we go. Stay. No. Nope. I got caps lock on. Yay! Okay, they need a better way to uh, organize these icons. That one. Oh no, that replaces the text. It's uh, like, I want text and icon. No, you can't do that. Alright, I've named the house. Moa Magnet? Yep. Sure. Not a lie. Okay, I've got a little room. We got so many T-bones. Yeah, because of all the drac. Yeah, even more. I'll all take right. some. I'll use them as my go, health food. I'm gonna go test my new tree chopping skills. You do that. I'm gonna put T-bones on my hotbar and they're the things that I'm gonna get my health back with. So I've got a 1% chance to auto fell a tree. <laughs> and I okay. should be picking up the wooden planks now instead of having to manually pick them up. Yep. Nice. Oh, oh, oh so fast. You're going to be king of the wood chop. Uh... Rock textured rock ejected from the earth. Okay, so we've got some shape obsidian, some obsidian, and some scoria. Can you do anything with that stuff? I don't know. Or do you need a higher tech level? I don't know. What I do know is I'm going to try out this watering can. Oh, we really need a way to do this with doesn't require me to drink and potentially get diarrhea. As I just did. Can you fill it up from the uh, the water collector? I could, but I should be able to fill up the watering can from the thing. Just use the rain collector. Oh. The watering can does multiple plots at once. Oh, nice. It's like the upgraded watering can in... Um, Stardew Valley. Uh, and yes, Capac and I do not live in the city. We live in like a satellite area that's sort of city, but sort of not. Uh, 
Run out of room. Chop down too many trees. Oh well. I mean, Capac and I already live about... It's like 10 k's away from each other. Yeah. About that. Ow! Ah, uh, Drax! Many Drax! Yep, I'm coming. Oof. Moving as fast as my diarrhea would let me take. Let me move. Ah! Uh, Let's see where. No, Codon, suburbs isn't correct. We grew up in the suburbs of a major city, but we are no longer truly in the suburbs of the major city. We're in such a confusing area that um, during all I the guess... COVID lockdowns, they kept changing the definition of what we were. Technically, Splitsy would probably count as being in a suburb of a minor satellite city of Sydney. And you were in the... I am in the CBD in quotation yeah. marks of a minor satellite yeah. city of Sydney. Why am I in the crafting menu? What was I making? I had some reason I wanted to get fibers then too. Oh, a torch. I need sticks. I mean, having the runs in anything can't be good, but having it in a spacesuit would indeed be possibly near on the worst. Uh, can't disagree with that. Alright. Grab those. Grab some more timber. Make another cupboard. Like to get to the to get to the airport from where I am would take about an hour and a half. Dependent on time of day. Like you know, peak hour would probably take about two and a half hours. have no sorting system so I don't care where you put things as long as you remember where they are. Hooray! No sorting system is my favourite sorting system. I know. Also I'm upgrading my bed. I might have picked up your bedroll, I don't know. Just... Oh right, I forgot there's a monster in the house now. <laughs> yeah, it's a little inconvenient. Ah, oh, so many fried tomatoes. I'm gonna put them in the cupboard. Food. What other thing do I want? Dried fatty T bone? Dried gaming meat, that'll do. Alright, health. Yay! Uh, 
The trouble with an airport bus <laughs> or a shuttle service is the infant with whom I will be traveling. Because, uh, yeah, there are services like that. They're not really fitted out for traveling with a small child, though. It needs to be in very specific things. I think you can go on a regular bus. I mean, we could go on the train, but then we'd have to get to the train station. And the train station's half an hour drive away. It's all just very fiddly. Public transportation sucks, in other words. Uh, Alright, we need nails. What else do we need for these walls? More wood. And we're going to need more fibers. More rope. Let's make a gate. Uh, should we sleep? Can we sleep? Yeah. What did I just throw on the ground? Oh well. Oh! What the? What just happened? Angry Moa! Angry Moa! Dead Moa. Turns out I named this place correctly. <laughs> Well, Sydney has trains from its airport, but you just have to... It's a private thing, so it's even more expensive. That ends up being cheaper to park, rather than paying multiple rail fares. Which is stupid. So stupid. Like, Kavak and I looked at it every year when we were, um... Travelling down to PAX together when we would fly. And nearly every time it worked out to be about the same in parking as it would have been in rail fare for the two of us. If you're travelling on your own, rail fare's better. But... Hang up! No! Drinks! There we go. That close to dead, were you? Not that close. No, but I got, got let out again. Should have named the house Wi Fi because it's a hot spot. Oh dear. Oh, I keep accidentally hitting my DPI button on my mouse, changing my sensitivity. Oh, it's annoying when that happens, isn't it? Oh. Arms coming along a bit, I see. Yep. I don't really have any need. Like, we've got such an enormous amount of food because it keeps being delivered to our front door. I don't really know that I'm going to need to be doing much farming. Hey, the right Kev, thanks for a prime sub. I think this is about the right scale, maybe. You know, we could put up some sort of spawn blocker thing, maybe. Oh, yeah. yeah it might be worth considering. That's... I've run out of walls. <laughs> hey, third, third, steal my fishing spot. Oh, is this water too shallow to fish in? Uh, could be. Oh no, that looks like it worked.
Oh, I need to make all the ropes again. What fun would a spawn blocker be? Um, once we've got a full wall around us, the spawns aren't really a threat, so it's just then comes down to repairs. That's usually when spawn blockers are fun. Because they save you a lot of painful repairs and rebuilds and stuff. Coming rainstorm. But I agree otherwise. Fish get rid of all the bacon. Wait, how did I get lacerated again? Probably one of the drax. Oh no, I think it was the pig. Oh, did a pig come for a drac that you were slicing up? Oh boy. I am level 18. We should possibly pick up a mission, I guess. I'm almost level 15. Which is good, because I can start working on getting my Berserker X skills up. <laughs> what are these Berserker X skills? Uh, uh, give me a sec. So, in Habitation, if you get far enough down the axe tree, you've got Berserker, which increases combat abilities with axes. Yep. Uh, plus 150% damage, 10% attack speed on That's axes. Pretty and then you've got Controlled Rage, which reduces the penalties for being Berserk, but also increases your uh, yield from chopping trees. Okay. That all seems pretty good. That seems like you'll like you'll get a big jump in the amount of damage you do. Hopefully. Yeah. Okay, I should now, scream the whole time fish. in berserker mode for realism. Ooh. Hey, come back. Where's the I house? can't hear you, it's too noisy. Where's the house? Don't know. Maybe? I didn't realize you'd gone to the lake. I thought you were back at the house. Oh wait, the animal says where the house is. Caught an emberjack. It was better than the last emberjack I caught. Good job. We're gonna need to repair the house. Ah, uh, you got it under control. You hope. Alright, make all of the rope. Oh, I can't believe how expensive these things are in rope! Ridiculous! Need so many to make these fortifications. Okay, this storm's getting pretty bad. You gonna Probably die out there while you're fishing? Hey, this storm's knocking over trees. That's my job. Alright, the worst bit of the storm's done. Oh, that was almost perfect. Yeah, I've got that thing where it's not showing me the different sections of the storm on the... Ah. Uh. Thingamajig. All right, we have to repair the poles. They take damage now. Ah, right, get out of the way! Dying of exposure here. 
fixing the house. It's dying of exposure here. Those windows are really annoying. How much better is stone compared to wood? Uh, it's a lot. It's a big noticeable difference. Daisy does seem to be happy inside. Food and water at 100%. Not stuck outside in the rain. Right, what do I need for that? Rope and wood. Oh, Capac, we're going to use so much wood on these exterior spikes. Should make you happy. Well, I have accumulated a fair amount. Every piece of uh, wall requires 80 timber to make the spikes for it. with me, Charla. Another purple dawn. Indeed. At midday. Yes. What? Why is there a section of wall over here on the ground? What? I don't know what you're talking about. It's a section of wall on the ground here and a gap in the wall. Oh, did it get broken during the storm or something? Did I? I forgot to put the fish chunk in the fire pit. What a tragic loss of a chunk. Thank you, Steinmai. Thank you for 22 months. Uh, yes, I am going to have a gate and I have placed it. go we have a complete encirclement and if we went and collect the stone bits I could make a um, bridge out of the stone from the person's house so I might go across there and collect it all right I'll get a bit more wood we're gonna need it and gonna need a whole lot of ropes too uh, we might need a gate on this side somewhere. Two gates? <sighs> such a big ask. How dare you ask for such a logical, sensible thing. I'll deal with that once I got more stuff made. Level up. Your timber. Alright, what have we got? We need to go up this way. Uh, 
increased felling damage with axes. Oh, sadly there are no drawbridges. Uh, the plan is for a simple fixed stone bridge using the stone parts from the house that we've been given the location of. And then possibly upgrading maybe the roofs, the roof in our house. Okay. But I'm going to get these spikes out first. And then I need to make walkway fortifications so we can get up and repair this stuff. Um, with building stuff, I'm not sure there are any talents, but I'm also like to reduce the costs, but I'm also not too worried about the costs of materials that we're using here because they're not that difficult of a thing to collect. Yeah. Alright, Kamek, show me where you want the gate. Uh, just on the opposite side from where the other one is, I guess. Okay. We got two gates. Oh no. Wanting to see if I could place the the spike while the mower was gonna get killed by it. trees more trees <laughs> oh Kevin you should um, look up what's required for a hedgehog because they're just wooden rope and that way you can make any of the excess wood into hedgehogs uh... which might be useful around our gates Hedgehogs is, yeah, wooden rope. Which means we'll probably need you to go farm some fibers. Yeah, or you could like, you could proper farm, do like an actual fiber farm. Yeah. That's probably not a bad idea at this point. Because we are using a lot of rope. Oh. All these things. Finally got a fella tree in one hit thing. Nice. I already half chopped the tree, so it didn't, didn't really make a huge difference, but... Okay, how many do I need more? Oh, I only need two more spikes, and I've completely encircled this with spikes. Now, we do need to make sure we close the gates, though, Kamak. Nah. Uh. pieces I can carry of the house that we Ooh. yeah I don't really have another option unless you want to come with uh, what are you field. doing um, what are you even talking about I need to pick up the stuff 
from the other from the base. Oh. And I don't think uh, I'm going to be able to carry it all, which means it'll start taking damage when it's not uh, fully enclosed. Do you know where that base was? Ye kinda. Yeah, it was over there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I can come with. I just gotta drop all these. Alright, I'll, I'll head over. And see if I can, um, break it all down and I'll start heading back toward you. Once I've... Once I'm loaded up with all the bits. Yeah, Eon, I can imagine that would mess with your head. Hearing a VOD and stream simultaneously. It messes with my head when... I'm editing and I sit in TeamSpeak waiting for Kapak to turn up for a recording and he starts talking while I'm listening to him talking during the edit. Double Kapak. He's weird. And he's not something the world is ready for. Okay, that'll probably do it. Uh got a lot of stuff on me. <laughs> Single capac is weird, double capac is almost divide by zero. Do you disagree with this sentiment, capac? Nah. some food with me. I mean, we we approach like, I feel like some of the people we've played with have got some shared traits with you. Which is enough of an overlap. Well, orange. Yes, there's with bo with two of the regulars. There's oh, the yeah, orange judge, right? both TFE and Shadow. And wasted. Oh yeah, that's true. It's very true. Is Icarus a finished game? Um, Almost like it's the best color. It's a functional game, uh, but they still do weekly updates on it. And I haven't been getting the little hitches and stuff today. The performance is heaps better again. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I haven't noticed anything today. No. Um, much nicer to play. Yeah, I don't, I don't know that I'd say it's the best game, but it's definitely one of the best survival games out there at the moment. Yeah, I think that's a fair way to put it. Like, what would you class as the best game? Uh, You'd have to be more specific and say a specific, like, within a genre, wouldn't you? Yeah, probably. What would I say? Thanks, Elemental. <laughs> Thank you for the 8 bits. Um, Splitzy also wears orange. He's just from a black and white universe. Weirdly kind of true. Because of the number of times for thumbnails or when we were shooting um, Light Echoes, Kapak and I would have to change between each other's suits. My default suit color is actually orange, fully desaturated. But, uh, but the brightness has to be... Uh, the value has to be adjusted because otherwise it would just be white. Capex is 15, 100, 100. And mine, the hue doesn't matter. But yeah, Icarus isn't a finished game, but it is a... It is one of the survival games, especially now that you can do the missions on world and stuff like that without having to repeat 
repeatedly do the same tech progression over and over. Uh, it is one uh, that Kavak and I have both had a lot of fun in. How hours am I at in Icarus now? 220 plus, I think 100 in the beta. Uh, true, Icarus is not an early access game, and the devs would uh, agree with you on that. Well, I mean, like early access is used as like a catch-all term, but like different people's ideas of early access are very different. It's true. was already fairly well fleshed out and working when they released it in early access and then kind of feels like everything that they've added since then in early access up to its actual release this week or something oh is it gone have they done the 1.0 this week uh, i'm not sure I, th I think it's pretty soon if it hasn't happened already all of that just feels like a bonus. Uh, there's a big, big patch for uh, Dark Tide is due this week. They've completely redone the uh, the skill tree. Oh, yeah. So it's an actual skill tree now. And it sounds like they're adding some interesting stuff. Like with the Ogrens. By default they have the grenade box they can throw. Um, but they're, they're adding a skill for the Ogrens, which means they can throw rocks. They have an infinite supply of rocks, but they don't do as much damage. Right. So if you just want to go around... <laughs> Pegging chunks of rock at zombies. Yep. That's a thing you can do. So I'm pretty keen to see what the options are for all the different classes and what I can do with my current okay. character builds. Although I, I'm a little concerned that it's going to break some of the theming that I had for some of the, the characters' loadouts I've put together. Yeah. I've been having extra fun with my, my flamethrower Psyker ever since I got him a cool bird helmet. Alright, um, I'll give you some. Uh, you're still going to be encumbered even taking this. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, so I'll give you enough that you're not encumbered and then you can come back and grab more from me if I still haven't managed to get to you. I'm encumbered. <laughs> Alright. Ask me how much you need to be unencumbered. Uh, okay, I'm 20 kilos over. There we go. Alright. Is that all the stuff? Yeah, I've got everything. So if you run back and then come back and grab me, we should be able to be unencumbered, maybe? Uh, I don't know if I can run back all that much faster. No, oh, we'll see. Uh, we haven't got the unlock to make stuff out of worm bits. No, but in a coming update, the open world will get all of the missions. Oh. Uh, on so Prometheus has all the missions currently, but the old maps will also be getting all the all the missions in a coming update. So when that update comes out, we can go back to our castle and run some of the missions to unlock those skills for these characters if we want. That's a more fun way of oh. doing it than having to build everything up from scratch. We can just jump in there and get those skills. Did you just... 
breaking ankle the, jumping in the water. I thought the river would break my fall, but instead it broke my ankle. Ah, unlucky for you because it only sprained mine. Uh, do you have any ropes on you? No. Of course not. Can you make ropes? Not without building a whole house. Well, I guess I have a drink while I'm here. Oh, I'll just have a bit of a nap. Always wondered how I got the batteries to speak in Capex voice. Oh, you're talking about the the damage from that was a weird broken mod interaction. Thank you, Theron. Well, Thank you for two months. I'm stuck here for four minutes. So, Kabak, you know how the, um... Oh, you're actually stuck stuck. Yeah, I can't move. Oh, well, I should probably come to you. I didn't realize you were fully stuck. You know how Twitch does its whole pushing subs thing? Or September or whatever it is. Yeah. The nice thing about that is that it means that all the people who are just going to sub anyway save 30%. Oh, I need bone armor. Paid for by whoever the sponsor was. What requires DLC? Currently unavailable for purchase. Grrr. What? Bone armor. That oh, says bone, Twitch drop. Bone armor chest Twitch drop. I don't know, that was a thing. Wait a second, wait a second. I guess second. they haven't... I don't think they've enabled it yet. No. Because you have to, um... You have to like link your Twitch account and stuff. Yeah. Well, I've got drops enabled by default, so they mustn't have done them yet. There's a mower guarding you. Oh, a steel heater shield. That looks cool. Oh, there's also a boar over Thanks, here. Thanks, Thank you for the prime sub. Oh. Come on, get in the water. Oh, that works. <laughs> One dead mower. Yes, the worm weapons are from uh, Olympus, and but yeah, I think I think we'll probably just wait till those missions are available before we go back and try and get them. Oh no. How much longer on your broken ankle? Uh, 100 seconds. Alright, give me something heavy. Doesn't matter what it is. Seriously? <laughs> um, my weight capacity is 75. So... Can you move? I can move! I think asking you to come along actually made that take longer. Probably. I <laughs> uh, don't want to worry about taming the mower because I don't have any bed set up and I don't have all that. Although we do have a semi-secure compound now. I could. I'll deal with it later. That is true, Xando. You can edit the character file to enable the worm stuff, but I don't know. I always find that stuff, like edits and cheats and stuff, for me, the way I am, uh, to be a slippery slope. Once I start it, I kind of feel like it takes a lot of the... Um, it takes a lot out of it for me. Yeah... That said, though, we have I feel like maybe before. those kind of unlocks should be like account wide rather than character wide. Yeah, so you don't have to do the same missions multiple times. Yep. 
Yeah, although I, at least at least once it is available, like those missions are available from the open world, it will be very easy for us to go and finish them. I mean, you say that, you still have to actually go do the missions. Yeah, but because we've got all of our equipment all ready to go. And how does that work with this new map anyway? What do you like, mean? Because presumably it's got its own missions to it does. unlock stuff. Well, not, but it won't unlock those things because they're Olymp that's an Olympus mission. Oh, it's an Olympus mission, not a Styx mission as well. Ah, dang it. Yeah, but there'd have to be a mission for this map that lets you make stuff out of the worm bits. No, I think you have to go to Olympus to do it. What? Yeah. Bone Armor was supposed to be a Twitch drop for the DLC launch, but apparently there were legal issues with that plan, so it hasn't been released yet. What legal issues? Yeah. What, has yeah. somebody copyrighted Bones or something? Someone would try, I'm sure. Well, I want the bone armor because apparently it gives you, like, melee resistance. I could really use that right now. Ah, uh, copyright. So broken. Such a trigger point for Capac. Well... It should be for everybody. <laughs> Didn't say it shouldn't be, but thought. But when, always find that one. When Games Workshop tries See? to copyright a common term that predated them by about 50 years. Orcs? Space Marines. Ah. Uh. And now their thing is they do spl slightly different spellings of everything so that they can copyright their special version. Right. Bone armor equals exoskeleton. Yeah, how about I can have his exoskeleton? Finally. Do you know what will annoy Capac about the Twitch drop thing though? I actually have Capex stream up in full on my other screen. Which means I get I get drops and stuff from having that open. I don't think Capex setup would give him the drops for watching for li looking at my chat. Um I could maybe. I don't think you get it for chat. You get it for what having the full stream up. Yeah, well, I could potentially have it up in a small window. Okay. Am I? Because that's probably um, the easiest way to do it. Have you seen Spiffing Brit's latest video about breaking YouTube? 30,000 live views or something? Yeah, he had... Um, I, I, I find Spiffing Brit's videos obnoxious to watch. Um, <laughs> even though I don't didn't find him particularly obnoxious in other things. But yeah, I find his, his way of editing, I find it really obnoxious. Well, He repeats uh, himself so many times, it's so painful. Long story short, he... Yeah, exactly. Long story short. <laughs> he did a YouTube live stream where he had all his viewers open as many windows of the stream as possible and each separate window counted as a different view. Right. Even though they were like from the same account. And then oh. he had them all uh, refresh those windows and each one counted... Uh, Wait a second. Oh, it, yeah. And then if he if he ran an ad, each separate view window counted as a separate yeah. like ad view. Yeah. But then there was there was also something about refreshing the windows. Oh, I think that was for likes. Huh. You could multiply likes by doing something with like refreshing all the windows or something. Yeah. Yeah. 
But I, I found the most interesting part about the stream was that he he pointed out that there may be people doing it already because you have these weird 24-hour children's streams on YouTube that are just like playing the same content but they've usually they're usually running like multiple of them at a time and they have like huge viewer counts but then when you go back and look at the vods like after they've got tiny viewer counts oh so YouTube add up corrects with... it later well like the the weird thing is that like usually like Spiff said that when he does a live stream like the, the views on the VOD later are like a certain sort of percentage of like the... Why can't I open the thing? There we go. Like he gets X amount of views from the people that watch it during the live stream. But the, those numbers are completely bonkers broken on these weird kid streams. Some light might help me here. Time to cook more meat. Well, I was wondering whether that was potentially something with like that low, the lo-fi girl or whatever it is, the that music stream. Uh, I don't know what that is. Oh, I think it does look good as a flooring material. Because I was thinking, like. I'm not saying they are intentionally doing that. I'm saying I wonder if it's unintentionally helped them out. Uh, the alien planet is very purple and blue. Accurate. Blue in the shade. It's a surprisingly vibrant shade of blue for shade. Actually, I need to eat some food, not just cook it. There we go, we have a bridge. Uh, I've got some more walls here. Do you want more walls? Yeah. I don't know. Do I want more walls? Uh, something's dying on the spikes over here. Yeah, that's going to happen a lot. There's a pig. I'm just going to leave that like that for now. It's fine. It's totally fine. Oh, apparently it's cold. Oh, it might be because I went in the river, though. Uh, what am I doing? Yes, the gate leaves quite the impression, indeed. Just people talking about colors in the chat, and I just realized I haven't even gotten any blue yet. Any blue paint? Uh, yeah, don't worry about it. This building's I old. kind of like it and don't like it at the same time, yeah. Um, Kind of the same, of, of a similar mind. I need a new torch. Do we have some sulfur in here somewhere? Oh, we can get up on some of the ramparts now. Yep. Would be easier to watch if it was daytime. Uh, more nails. 
be easier to watch if there weren't a big old lunking turtle cow in the way too. <laughs> we can probably move it outside now. by you so apparently I can't tell it to do nothing. Ah. Yeah that old chestnut. Uh, there should be an animal bed in one of the chests there somewhere. Yeah. Alright we have half of the wall with ramparts to get up on. I think it's the small half, but fine. Actually, maybe not. Oh, they're pretty even. As halves should be. I deliberately said smaller half. Well, this is making hunting a lot easier. <laughs> uh, yeah. It's also probably making a lot of things die on a die out there and attract predators, but and they too will die. Uh, all right, talent points. I've got a bunch. There was something in survival that I wanted. Ah, dense packing too. Do I want skilled picker. Do I want rock star. This skilled picker, since I am. No, that's harvesting by hand. I want harvesting by hand. Right, we'll go rocks up. There we go. Well, the problem with all these spikes is that not getting the actual kills. Yeah. That is an issue. Oh. That's better. I don't like it when it's floating. I might need to fix this one up too. Disappointment. Have I, have you collected any more sulfur recently? Uh, I've got some on me. I was going to make more farm plots, but I've to put fibers in. Yeah. It's not a lot. Oh well. It's one plot. Find some sulfur. I think I can just grab some wood. Oh, I've got wood on me. What did I want wood for? I don't know. I was about to make something. I didn't have any wood. Oh no, I need to start the fire. That's what I needed. Oh, there are so many animals dead on our things. Some of this food cooked. Looks like a North American 1800s fort. Where's the outhouse? Uh, that's the creek. <laughs> you chuckle <laughs> like you didn't immediately think of that, Kevin. <laughs> You're alive or dead? I think you're alive. This pick sounds funny. Oh, 
Oh, maybe I'll go get a swamp tree. Oh, good news. I think the prediction's about to end. Ah, take that prediction. What is there to be afraid of in this game? Well, there's weird monsters that shoot needles at you in the swamp. Yeah, that's one of the things. That slow you as they do it as well. Should make me enough farms for the fiber farm. Ooh, a strider. Oops, almost asked as a question. Apparently, there's a swamp gale happening in this swamp. Oh, it's quite peaceful out here. Well, our base uh, suddenly has taken on a new scale with the wall. Well, at least we should die a little less often inside our house now. Easier to get up there than I thought. How goes the swamp logging? Yeah. I'm not getting anything different than usual, but. Well, apart from the critters that might start attacking you. But the trees here do do the uh excessive dust particle thing like the palm trees in the desert do. Ah. Yep, I've got the auto pick up wood wood power. It has greatly increased the speed of my plank acquisition. Is that so? No. Thing stopping when it runs out of space. Yeah, the bombing the bombing creatures were pretty cool. I kinda like them. Don't have enough room. I'll eat these tomatoes. You waste my tomatoes. No, they're wild tomatoes. Well, I guess that's fair enough then. I don't have enough room for leather. Oh, combine those stacks. Are you going to get the turtle monster out of the house yet? No. I'm going to leave it in there until it drove you truly insane. Oh. What the... Hmm. What? A cushiony bit on my headphones was coming loose, so I reached up to my head and I felt sticky goo. <laughs> Oh, was that's adhesive. Not, that's not what you want to feel when you go to scratch your own head. I mean, it's not what you want to feel when you scratch anybody's head. What am I colliding with? Why is there this little mound? Yeah, whatever. Oh, 
Sounds a bit crooked. Looks a bit like the veggie patch I made in my own backyard. Alright. Uh, the bits. crooked veggie patch. Yeah, I didn't do the best job with it. I didn't do the worst job with it. I didn't do the best job with it. Level 19 now. Most important number of all. Wouldn't you agree, Capac? Parked his rig in a Dixie Pig in the year of 99. There we go. See? Don't you, Capac, would agree? You know that nobody that. <laughs> Doesn't know what we're talking about. He's gonna understand any of that. <laughs> well, yeah, pretty much. But surprising, the number of people reacted when I used um, uh, a quote from it for our nineteenth. No, for the nervous breakdown. No, no, no. I made the um, the dark towers on the moon back in. Escape from Purgatory? There were 19 of them. Ah. And I had other references with them. Well, Kabak, I think I'm going to wrap up here. Are you going to keep streaming some Noiter or some Dark Tide or something? Uh, yeah, I might do a couple of Dark Tides. See if the patch is up yet. And if not, enjoy the last of the current skill tree. I'm just gonna sneak around here and watch you get electrocuted. But nobody has ever been electrocuted while trying to catch a fish in the middle of a storm. <laughs> no. Oh no, my my fishing rod's gotten out of focus. <laughs> yeah, because I went into the camera mode to watch you get zapped. Oh, I got a new, better crimson Springfield. Cool. Um, uh, yeah. So, I'll be back on Friday with some more... What was I doing on Friday? Imperion. That's right. That's what I'll be here back on Twitch next for. Uh, Kapak will be back tomorrow with me with... on his channel with more of Boulder's Gate. True. And then we'll both be back on my YouTube channel on Wednesday for more assertive acquisitions, but also Capac will be streaming on Wednesday doing his painting. Yeah, by doing my workbench stream, I'll be doing the finishing touches on the Chaos Space Marines and starting to paint up their champions. Because Capac now streams four times a week. Maybe also some cultists and everything is dying on the fence. Yeah, yeah. There's an Ubus out there too, dying on the fence. Oh, Anubis. Yes, Anubis. Maybe even an Apophis. Yeah! What? Oh, well, I did get some bestiary progress at least. Uh, the, the, does the kill get shared? Uh, looks like it. Oh, that's good. Oh, that is very, very handy. Apparently, uh, so yeah. you get bestiary progress for skinning it as well. Huh. So there's all that and plenty more to come. And what? we will see you then. What? Exactly. What? Bye.